Welcome to the educational vi video um, showing how we can inject a knee joint with uh, local anesthetic and steroid or for that uh, matter we could use a dual hyaluronic acid and the same technique applies for aspiration of the knee joint as well. Okay, the first thing is you've got to make sure you, you disinfect the knee. So here we are, I'm just going to organize our chloraxidine or, or denadine, whatever you have. Ask the patient to internally rotate their leg. Good. Okay. okay. So, surface anatomy. Okay. Uh, patella, patella tendon, tibial tuberosity, quadricep tendon. Okay. It's got a bit of muscle wasting, but that besides the point. Here's a, here's the patella. Behind the patella lies the femoral condyles. Okay. This is the epicondylar area there, and in here, the suprapatellar pouch. So, quadricep tendon runs here. The femur bone runs it and there's a gap in between here between the quadricep tendon and the femur okay so here we are i have drawn up a bit of local anesthetic in this case i have i've used a, a pvk okay and i've used one ampule of celestine which is 7.5 milligrams of, of celestine so what we do here is we fuel for the patella Go to the superior pole of the patella. You could use an anesthetic if you wanted to, but this is a 19 gauge needle, which is quite small. It doesn't hurt that much. So you're giving a local anesthetic if you've got a child or something, I'm sure you would, but in this case, I'm sure he'll, 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 he'll manage pretty well. So here we are, patella, superior pole of the patella. The femur runs over here. That's the quadricep tendon. And you aim straight towards the bone, okay? And then drop your hand and you're in, okay? Now you can inject in the suprapatellar pouch. I do a high volume infiltration, about 10 mils of it. And that's because it infiltrates throughout the knee joints. And the knee joint is like a, like a, um, a typical space. Here we are, okay. And then we ask the patient to flex and extend his knee, move the knee up and down, to make sure that the steroid and the local anesthetic sort of disperses throughout the joint, okay. And then we just take a little, uh, and then, you know, cutie So I mentioned uh, Duralane, which is a synthetic um, lubrication or hyaluronic acid. So it comes in an ampule like this. It's quite a viscous uh, fluid. So you should have some local anesthetic. I've, I've already put a, a bit of local anesthetic. So same concept, patella tendon. Now just relax your leg, relax, relax, that's it. Okay, and this is where I put the local. So I'm gonna put the local you know, through there and in the bone there and work my way up. There you go. And I'm gonna inject this in the knee joint, just like that. Done. Okay, so every time, same spot, works really well. Excellent, thank you.